Well, folks, it's a miserable Wednesday afternoon at Pencloud, and uh, it's time for a vlog. And what am I doing before that? Yeah, you know me too well, the new. Look at this. We have a bottle of uh, Diet Coke there, nice and cold. And always the start of the show there, a small fish and chips with a Roma chippy across the road there. Smell everything at the ready, and this, and this gets stuck in for the taste test, so stand by. Cheers to the uh, Diet Coke there. And here come the uh, chips, right? Watch this. Mm. Yep. Ah, get going. Mm. Ah, that's so good. Mm -hmm. That's right? Good. Well done to Roma Chippy and all the gang there and Tom was in the other day doing some work for once and uh, awesome other. and I'll get back to you in due course now for, for a little chat so stay tuned So folks, welcome back to this uh, vlog today Wednesday afternoon vlog <coughs> You're from Penclough, excuse me. And uh, just, as you just saw there a moment or two ago, and a, a small fish and chips from the Roma Chippy, across there beyond you, and as always, yeah, nice. Yes, how are you all doing, folks, by the way? Not done a blog for a while. I'm doing uh, good, thanks, sir. Um, you know, I'll tell you what my, what my news is in a moment. Uh, weather today is not well. Where's the water was? Sunshine gone. And now we've got this light rain stuff now. It's, it's balmy weather, so hopefully the weather will, be, will pick up but now in the next uh, few weeks, you know, a week or two. But it should be fine on the weekend, so hopefully we'll do a, a walk on Saturday. Because that's what I've been up to really these days, uh, you know, I've been, you know, I've been uh, doing some organ stuff. And the walks, you know, I've been uh, doing a few walks there, you know, as you've seen on my channel. But uh, a warm welcome to new subscribers to my channel actually, as it happens. Since I last done a blog, I'm um, not sure how many I was on subscribers, but now I've got 16,555 subscribers. So if you are new to my channel, folks, just, just, just drop a comment down below and say, hey, hey Rob, I'm new, like, innit? So I like doing the odd blog here and there when I can get a chance. Do the, I do with the organ stuff. I like going out on walks and stuff. So that's what, that's what I like doing now. Hopefully, the weather will be. Good now, the next uh, week's ahead now. Because I did um, a, a couple of walks recently, recently as, as you would have seen. I uh, went down Oxford to Batinan. Then I had a, have a little rest for a week then. I had a blister on my foot. That seems to, uh, it's all gone now. And I did a little stint down at Mumbles. And then I went down Rosilly then uh, quite recently as well. And then uh, yesterday, what I do, or, or the other day, um, went down Park of Rios on a usual little walk down there. I've been down there for a little while, so that video will be coming up soon for you all to enjoy and just appreciate what I did. And you know, when the, and the outtakes, Mr. Bond always laughs at them. And the uh, yeah, the shotgun gag was in there. I had two takes of that, mind you. See, you'd be laughing your head off, Paul, if you wa if you are watching this video, this, this video. You know. So yeah, so um, yeah, I said on the video on on when I did the walk uh, Thursday I do another walk but I got something on on Thursday so we, as I say now we'll do a walk on Saturday the weather be should be alright should, should be nice weather so uh, yeah we'll go over to uh, Landy Moor Marsh I've been over that way for a little spell so we walk up from Cheriton through the fields down the bridge and then down into Landy Moor Marsh you know so that would be a nice walk to do 
Hopefully, weather be nice. It should be all right, actually. It should be should, should be nice. It should be nice weather. Hopefully, well. Yeah, so I've been you know I've been doing some organ stuff on my bike out. Uh, you know, I've been doing some uh, Welsh tunes, hymn tunes, just suit the mere scene, and I did some organ music in between. I, I got a, about three more sets of videos to to put together. So you'll see those in due course when I get a chance. And that's what I've been up to uh, basically, really. I've uh, been doing the geocaching, and that's uh, going really well. Um, I tell you what, I mean, I'm on now, caches wise. They shot up a hell of a lot. Um, 3,624. <laughs> yeah, so there was a, a, a geocaching annual geocaching event um, last month or two up in uh, Ashtagandais and. Uh, uh, and there was like about like 80 odd caches or more p published and as so we did those over two days with me and Stan you know uh, Stan the man uh, we did about 50 well, we found about 57 finds 57 we went up there on the Saturday uh, did a flash mob in Craig and Ross Country Park and then just a cache in there and then I never further up then then Sunday then, did a CITO caching trash out event and then did, did a load of caches there and then went to the main annual um, event in the evening which is all very enjoyable, I have to say and I uh, was out all day, I mean all day, like open on hours all day, and I came home about, when we got up there about 10 o'clock in the morning and came back about 10 o'clock in the night I was absolutely buggered yeah, there's lots more caches to do up there, so we'll get round to doing those, finish on, and then there's finishing those off. That's what I've been up to, really. Yeah, so, yeah, when I was, uh, did the walk on Park of Rios, uh, no, I, I know the people in the Gower Heritage Centre. You know, I wonder if they can give me free access to the place. Well, I give a lot of publicity to the place, you know, outside, and perhaps they might give me free access in, inside the, the centre, you know. Um, the people who own the who own the, the Harris Centre are members, or they're part of the nearby Park, uh, Park Mill Chapel, just 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 down a, you know just just down the road. It was about, it was about three minutes, about four and five minutes walk. I've been to this organ on many occasions in the past, and uh, I, I can always go in there. I haven't uh, found the contact yet, but anyway, I can you know I can reach out to the woman, uh, the lady. She has a key. You can go and get the key. Go and, go and play in the organ in the, in the chapel there. The, the organ needs playing there, so hopefully we'll get in there and do some stuff there on the organ, and uh, hopefully we can get back into All Saints mumbles. I'm just trying to reach out to somebody there. Hopefully we can get in there. Been a long while. I think they getting the organ done eventually. I'm not sure when they're actually doing it. And uh, another many I haven't been to for a, well, quite a long while. Is the Sacred Art Centre in Morrison. Hopefully we can get in there soon. I think I think they're doing some building work there. Not sure. So we'll uh, see what happens. Uh, no, apart from that, I'm fine anyway. I'm battling on. I'm, you know, I'm still here. Like you know, but, you know I'm just after it. God went in. <laughs> anyway, what else has been happening? Right then, the main uh, thing in this video today. Now you've obviously seen February about February this year. To book March and, and so on onwards, you may be aware that I've done a fundraising page on the Hlamatic Church organ. I did a couple of videos about it and I mentioned it in my blog, so what I've been up to and how far I've got on the total. And I, I know people have you've donated as well, people on um, Facebook and YouTube and everywhere, and you know, people from the community have donated, you know, which is absolutely fantastic. I put a few bob in, you know, here and there. I should, shouldn't, have, shouldn't have to do it, but you know, there we are. I put a link out there on, my, on the community page. If you would like to give a donation, please do so. I don't know what the hell's going on there. But anyway, I've managed to raise now three thousand, three thousand pounds. You know, some, but somewhere, which is absolutely incredible. And there's some good news and some bad news. Well, we want first about the bad news, right? Well, the organ in Clamada Church has been in the has been in place you now for the last thirty years, right? It, you know, when it was working, it was working great. And the console has seen better days. Well, the console is fine, but the editorials are just absolutely kaput. And 
it would have cost about 12, 12, 1,275 1, to do all the electronics and, uh, and new console speakers. But I wanted to see about getting a better audio setup and uh, looked into the avenue. Well, we had a conversation with Martin, the owner of Eminent. Well, he said it would cost about £3,000 for, 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 for a full upgrade. I thought, oh, great, okay. Plan B. So, we're going to retire the organ. Just, you know, it's been in that church for 30 years. I think spending money on an old console of that degree, you know, is. Well, when you, you know, it's like, when you, it's like when you spend money on an old car, you know, that's causing problems. Well, you know, I'd rather just buy a new car, you know, you know buy a new car and then get on with it. So, the good news is that he's got um, organs available, second hand organs that are very good. Now, they're eminent alphas. Very similar to what was uh, once in Sheridan Church. As you see on my channel over the years, I've done videos and they produce a very, very good, a fantastic sound for what they're worth. And uh, I've picked an organ that I like. It's an it's Eminent Alpha, it's 200 CH2, whatever it's called. It's got all the gimmicks. Uh, you might see some photographs of it right now, actually. Yeah, I can see there, nice uh, organ. It's, you know, it's much of the same um, colour scheme as the pews in the church. It's got all the gimmicks, uh, all the full play and A's, the volume pedals a lot. Um, the And it's also uh, with two speaker cabinets as well, external speaker cabinets, if I can fit them in the church. If not, I'd probably be concert speakers. The organ uh, came from a, a church that seated 600 people. And it's been modified with bigger amplifiers and, and so forth. It makes it be a very powerful bass, actually, according to Martin, the owner. Um, it's Professor Ian Tracy, Cathedral Organs in Liverpool Cathedral, has given many of titles on it as well, so we know it's going to be a good organ. And it's uh, it, it costs £1,250. Bargain! So we say a lot of money against. Uh, a new uh, against you in the console. The con this this organ is about twenty years old, and as you see in the photographs, there it's in very you know it looks in right fine neck. It's just a little bit of a missing here and there. He said, but not, but nothing to worry about. It works really well. Um, so I had to pay about about say about three hundred quid for the delivery, and that's going to come now in about July time because he's going to go away on holiday and then for two weeks and he'll come back then hopefully then he'll, we can get we can get him to come down and drop and put it in the church do all the voicing do the voicing and uh, just 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 have us where we can uh, do the uh, how we can get the speakers put in place uh, maybe one by the organ one, one in the pulpit so we'll see what happens there uh. so it's very exciting stuff and it's got, you know, it's, it's, got, it's got all the gimmicks. It's, it's got the theatre mode on there that I liked uh, using on the last Eminent in Cheriton. So that's been, that's going to be a bonus there. And it's uh, going to go, it's going to fit in really well in the space of the church that it's in. So that's uh, a good sign. So I don't know what to do with the money I got left over. Well, I'm hoping, well, i got to get the Viscount sorted out because it's something. There's a speaker problem inside the organ that's causing a rattle or it's overloading. So I'm going to get that looked at. Um, reach out to Anthony Packer, the, the organ dude, and he'll come soon now to fix the organ driver. That's probably causing the problem. Not until, we know, until we get inside the console, behind the panel, and see what's going on. And then maybe if the money I got left over, I might look at the avenue of adding a sub bass speaker on the organ to you know to extend the bass line so there's a more reliable bass and i think that's what's causing the problem of the of the situation i'm not sure mine but uh hopefully we can look at the avenue to see what it'd be like in the church in the in the building because it's, it's, it's a good sound mind when you're in the building but it needs it needs that sort of support with the bass so that it has a chance to breathe better and to Give it more of a chance not to be in the console. So that's the idea what I got. So we'll see what happens with that. But, uh, if not, then when I got it, I might upgrade my computer.
well, well you know, see what happens anyway, you know, and, uh, but uh, that's the idea and I'm going to do, ho hopefully add the, the sub bass speaker on the organ. Because there's a volume, which people say, oh, oh, it's too loud in the church. It's, it's, it's not, people are not technical minded. There's a volume control on the back of the speaker and there's also a volume control at the console to control the sub bass output. So there's not um, the end of the world. So, uh, yeah, so that's the idea. Hopefully we can, I can get that done and sort it out and uh, we go from there basically. So that's all my news, that's all my news basically, when I got to report. So I'm going to sign off here now. I've been, I've been going on here now for the last 13 minutes now, just talking a load of rubbish. So hopefully now you'll see the walk I've done now, parked up Rias, coming up after this one, and then you'll see some videos of Cheriton and uh, the Welsh tunes I've done and some organ music, so you'll see those. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching this vlog. I look forward to hearing your views and your thoughts down below about the new organ, about the new organ, the second-hand organ console. And uh, yeah, so thanks for watching and I'll speak to you soon. Hovo and tag Nevid.